This is butter miso shrimp recipe. You can serve this over rice or do what I did and this is an appetizer. So I'm here in my office and obviously you can see that my kids have been here as well. <laughs> I've never seen shrimp disappear faster than with this recipe. Your guests will love it. Now you can serve this miso butter shrimp over rice as a main dish or you can do what I did and have a bunch of little um, picks right next to the shrimp and it's finger food. It's wonderful. I promise you will love it. Use this a classic Japanese combination of miso paste, sake, and mirin. Sake, of course, is Japanese alcohol and the mirin is Japanese sweet wine. Here's what you need. Melted butter, Japanese sake, which is Japanese alcohol, and if you don't have Japanese sake, you can use bourbon or whiskey. You know what? Your drink of choice. And you'll need some miso paste. This is miso and easy. Uh, you can use this product or just regular miso paste. Most supermarkets will have miso paste. Either look in the Asian aisle or near where the tofu is. You'll also need mirin, which is Japanese sweet wine. And of course, shrimp. Last ingredient is ginger. I take peeled fresh ginger and use a rasp grater and just grate it instead of chopping it. It's so much easier and you get very fine um, grated ginger. Take the melted butter and a large bowl whisk, add the sake, and you can have a shot of it yourself too. Uh, mirin, add the miso, and kind of whisk that together. Add the ginger, the grated ginger. I used about a teaspoon of grated ginger. And add the shrimp. Now I only, I only made uh, enough for two people in this, so if you're making more, of course you're gonna have more shrimp. You can either grill this outside, you can broil it, you can grill it in a pan, whatever you want. I have a grill pan here, and I'm gonna go ahead and grill a shrimp just a couple minutes each side, make sure you don't overcook it. Just until the shrimp is cooked through. And go ahead and serve it with some toothpicks, and that's it. For the full recipe, come on over to steamykitchen.com slash 104.